All right, I've got something today that I am super excited about. I have one of my second, third favorite cuts of meat. This is a pecan roast. It's beautiful. It's also called a sirloin top roast. And it's got this fat cap on here that is gorgeous. Do not remove the fat cap. That is what makes the whole thing delicious, moist. This is melt in your mouth. This is a real treat. Um, the biggest thing you wanna do is you wanna leave it out about 45 minutes to an hour before you cook it. Um, that's gonna make sure it cooks evenly throughout without getting like well done bits and then rare bits. You want this a beautiful medium rare throughout the whole thing. So leave it out. I promise you it makes the world of difference. While it's coming to room temp, start coating it with black pepper. Let it start to marinate while you wait. Okay, it's been about 45 minutes. Now, let's get some salt on there. And then what you wanna do, super important, this fat, you wanna cut slightly into it. Not all the way to the meat, but just slightly in. And this is called scoring it. Okay, I have a cast iron pan here that's been preheated. The oven is preheated to 400 degrees. You're gonna put a little bit of grapeseed oil in the pan. Take our steak. Want to do about two minutes each side and then into the oven. Flip it to the fat cap. Sear off some of that fat. Look at that. That's beautiful. This is the color you want. You want a really deep, rich brown on this. Okay, going into the oven for about 20, 25 minutes. 400 degree oven. Okay, once this comes out, I'm gonna serve it with an onion, garlic, and tomato butter. Dice up an onion. Then, dice up a tomato. Crush up five cloves of garlic. Okay, go ahead and take it out. Transfer your steak over to a plate. Then, in the same pan, take your onions you just chopped. Put your onions in. Let these cook and sweat down for a couple minutes. Then, once these have sweat down, they've got a good color on them. Throw in your tomatoes. Throw in your crushed garlic. Put in some oregano. Put in a tablespoon of butter. Let all these delicious flavors, let them simmer for about 10 minutes. Okay, here we have our beautiful steak. It's rested. See what we got. Look at that. Beautiful medium rare. Now when it's time to serve, take slices of this beautiful steak. and serve it with some of your onion, tomato, garlic, butter. And that looks amazing.